Today through this video we are going to learn if we have any equipment which runs on single phase and we have another equipment which runs on three phase power supply then among these two whose electricity bill is going to be more. For example, suppose we have a heater which runs on single phase. This heater we have rating of this is 1000 watt that is 1 kilowatt. Similarly, we have a heater which works on three phase and it is also of 1 kilowatt. It means both these heater are of same rating. Only difference between these two is this heater will operate on single phase and this heater will operate on three phase. So we have to find out among these two whose electricity bill will be higher. So for calculation, first of all let us understand how electricity bill is calculated. Electricity bill is generated according to energy meter. Units which are shown in energy meter is shown in kWh. Full form of kWh is kilowatt hour. Kilo which is written here it means 1000. It means if we have a equipment which is of 1000 watt, if we run this for 1 hour then in this condition energy meter shows consumption of 1 unit. Similarly, if load is of 2 kilowatt, then in this condition, after half an hour, one unit of electricity is consumed. In this way, energy meter shows consumption of units. Now, let us come to our question. Single phase power supply we have and three phase power supply we have. If we connect these with equipment of same rating, then in this condition, which equipment generate higher electricity bill? That is, which equipment consumes more number of units? To understand this concept, what we do? this heater of 1000 watt we run this continuously for 1 hour. So if we keep this heater running for 1 hour then in this condition energy meter will consume 1 kilowatt hour electricity that is 1 unit will be consumed. So this was for single phase. Now let us come to 3 phase. Same thing is for 3 phase. Equipment we have here is a heater of same rating that is same as of single phase equipment. Now what we will do we will keep this on for 1 hour. So when we keep 1000 watt load on for 1 hour then in this condition also energy consumption will be 1 kilowatt hour that is 1 unit will be consumed. If load is same for both then energy consumption is also same in both the condition. Here single phase power supply is there and when we connect 3 phase power supply with equipment then energy consumption in both the condition will be same. It means electricity bill will be same in both the condition. You can notice one thing here power consumption which we are calculating. In this we are not mentioning anywhere that whether it is single phase or three phase. It means in this power consumption calculation we are just multiplying power and time. That is how much load is running for how much time on the basis of this unit is calculated. From unit we calculate electricity bill. This is why for three phase and single phase power consumption is same. Now there can be a doubt in your mind that when we say what then there is a voltage also. And for single phase voltage is low and for three phase voltage is high. Then also why we are getting same unit or same power consumption. Ok then let us discuss about this also. To understand this concept what we will do let us use the formula for power. That is what equals to voltage into current into power factor. This was for single phase power supply. And for three phase power supply formula is what equals to root 3 into voltage into current into power factor. Here what means power? I directly written what here. Now through this formula only we will clear the whole concept. For single phase power supply power here is 1000 watt. In place of voltage we written 230. We don't know current and power factor is 0 0.8. Now let's solve this. When we solve this answer will come as 5.43 ampere. It means this heater of 1000 watt if it operates on single phase then in this condition it will consume 5.43 ampere current. Now in this three phase calculation how much current is consumed let's see this also. In place of power 1000 watt value of root 3 is 1.732 voltage here is 415 volt we don't know the current power factor is 0 0.8. Now let's solve this and find out the current. When we solve this answer will come as 1.73 ampere. It means if load is of 1000 watt and if we connect three phase power supply with this then in this condition load will draw 1.73 ampere current. So if we put this value of current in this formula then value of power will be same. That is power of single phase and power of three phase will be equal. Friends through this video we learned power source of single phase here voltage of this is low but when we connect this with equipment then it draws more current. This is why power rating is increased. 
Similarly, in case of three phase power supply, voltage is high but current is less and when we multiply these, then value of power calculated is equal to single phase. It means in both the cases, energy consumption is equal. Friends, if you want to know which will draw higher current, heater of 1 kilowatt or motor of 1 kilowatt, then click on the right hand side video to watch. Friends, I hope you like this video. If you like this video, then please do like, share and comment on this video. And if you didn't subscribe my channel yet, please subscribe.